Hi friends, it's Peachy. Today we will be making some moon glow necklaces. I've been seeing so many ads from this company on my Instagram and Snapchat, but if you've never heard of them, they're basically this company that will make jewelry with a picture of a moon from a special day in your life, such as a birthday or an anniversary. So for this DIY, you'll need a picture of a moon from the day of your choice. You can use their website to figure out which phase the moon was in, or you can search on Google, that also works. So once you know your moon phase, you can go on Google Images to get some pictures. I'm using Microsoft Word to arrange and print out my pictures. And I'm printing out a bunch of different sizes because I'm not sure which one will fit on my charm, so it's good to have extras. So to make the charm, you'll need a chapstick lid, and you'll also need some polymer clay. I'm using Fimo. I did not have a fun time with this clay at all. It was so old and dried out. Afterwards, we're going to roll out our clay and it should be about like five millimeters in thickness. And when you're done, just use the chapstick lid to make some small circle cutouts. The edges may be a bit rough, so you might need to like smooth it out a little bit with your fingers. So after you're happy with the circle shapes, just bake them in the oven according to the instructions on your package. Then we're going to cut and glue the moon pictures to the charms. If there are any white edges, you can use a sharpie to cover it up. So next, we're going to glue an eye pin onto our charms. I'm using UV resin, but you can also use super glue if you have that instead. So to make your moon charms glow in the dark, you'll need some glow in the dark powder or you can use glow in the dark paint. I'll be using this powder that I got off of AliExpress and mixing it with my UV resin. But if you don't have UV resin, you can mix it with other things too, like maybe nail polish or clear glue or Mod Podge. Any kind of clear varnish would probably work. So afterwards, your charms should glow in the dark. This is kind of what it looks like as it's glowing. So to make your charms into necklaces, you can make it into like a leather choker or just like a regular chain necklace. Um, I'm using this pre-made leather necklace rope that you just have to attach the charm onto. So to make the chain necklace, I'm using two chains and joining them together with a jump ring and putting the charm onto the jump ring. I think you can also just put the charm directly onto the chain, then you don't have to do this extra work. And if you're making your necklace from chains, you'll also need a lobster clasp and two more jump rings and just attach them to the ends of the chains. But um, you can also just use an existing necklace you already have, that's probably easier. So yeah, that's all you have to do to make a moon glow necklace. I hope you guys enjoy this DIY and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!